we're young people, we're all public policy students, so we think it's a really big deal to have NATO here. Other it's people true. in our generation, I don't know, I'm not, I'm not so sure. Um, Catherine Hagerman. I'm doing a uh, joint degree program also in All right, guys, so we've talked about, you know, the value of NATO to, um, to people of our generation, and I think we all agree that it's still a very valuable organization. Um, and we've talked a little bit about how um, the organization might evolve, especially the U.S.'s role. Or you would like to see for the future of NATO? Yeah, so uh, what I'm most concerned about is that uh, NATO comes up with a, uh, a successful plan for how we're going to transition out of Afghanistan. Um, I mean, they don't lose the eye of that most important priority. Um, I fought there, and I really don't want my kids to fight there, so I hope they figure out something that how they're going to keep it stable so they have to go back. For me, I think the key word is partnership, to increase the partnership, increase the alliance, and then also include um, certain countries that will be uh, of influence. So again, Pakistan, hopefully in the future, maybe India, China, because those are big countries that will play a big part in the world that will influence what happens to NATO, what NATO is, will be involved in in the future. Uh, I hope NATO will be able to uh, continue to find a commonality of interests and maintain alliance in that regard, but sort of touching on what you're saying, addressing the multitude of economic, political, and security interests between all the member nations. And I also hope it'll be able to include nations whose cultural values and societal values match those of the other NATO allies, so we may be more inclusive of those who want to join. I would love to see a NATO that is more inclusive of member interests, um, because there is a lot of there's a lot of sort of negative perceptions about well the U.S. is the main force um, behind what NATO does. I'd like to see that, and I'd also like to see um, more creative ideas as to how to address the problem of instability in different states and dealing with the implications of that instability.